to the channel so today's video is a collaboration video with Cheng and yeah um today we're gonna be doing a collaboration on as you guys can all tell by the title on a smoky look for Valentine's Day and yeah for beginners okay so this is a beginner Valentine's Day smoky eye look Alright, but first before we get started on this video, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below if you're not subscribed. Don't forget to give this a, a thumbs up as well. If you liked it, even if you didn't, come on, just give it a thumbs up and comment down below any type of video you like to see next. And yeah, let's get right into this video. Um, first, I will start with my eyebrows, but I'll fast forward it or probably not even put it in the video because you guys already saw I do my eyebrows on my last makeup tutorial on my chicha get ready with me. And yeah, I will definitely insert the card up there for you guys to check it out if you guys want to see how I do my eyebrows step by step. Or I can always do an in-depth video for me just, you know, doing my eyebrows. And yes, let's get started. So guys, this is how, how my eyebrows are going to be for this video and cleaning it up and doing it again. And once again, your eyebrows are not twins. They are sisters. So yeah, now I'll be using my Baker primer because, you know, on Valentine's Day, you normally go out for a very long time. So I'm using this primer. And I'll first apply it on the place I get real oily. Which is my T-zone. Oops. And this primer goes a long way so you don't have to put it up. Just that and now. You guys already know I like mixing my color corrector and my foundation and this is color orange corrector yeah from LA girl pro conceal I think it's almost, I'm, all, I'm almost out this should be good enough I go in with my Matte Poreless Fit Me Foundation by Maybelline. That should be good. Let's see. And now I'll just mix it with the brush. This brush, because I'll be applying it with this. Then keep it nice too. And that's what I need. Or yes, guys. Like I said, makeup is something you do. You know, practice makes you perfect. You know, and it really applies a lot in makeup because if you don't practice it, you lose it. And the more you practice, the better you get. And now since I don't have any more on my hand, I'll go in now with the foundation only and add another coat. I'm really running out of my products. Let's go shopping tomorrow because I don't want And it's just a little bit really. And I just tap before I mix it. And now I just go in a circle in a circular motion and make sure you don't just like glide it on your face. Some of your neck so your neck can match your face. It's a matte foundation, so don't worry, it will dry. So that's that and now I'll go in with my concealer so I can um, put my eyelids with And now I will go in with my banana powder. I mean, Sasha powder. So 
Now we're going with my Sasha Buttercup powder. And I'll just apply the little bit. Well, my beauty blender is damp. to work on the eyelids you guys don't even know I talked about this palette beauty glaze palette it was like $9.99 this palette was like $10 max you know and I got it from Amazon so I will go in with first of all as my transition color I'll be using brick red which is this color right here and I'll use as my transition color And to go back, I will use this um, same transition color. I will add Hermetity, this color right here. You guys know we are going in for a smoky look, so we need like dark colors or like um, colors that are just like closer to black. As possible as a transition and now I'll go in with this color right here it's called black yeah my, the one I'm gonna use as my um, smoky and on the outer eye make sure you dab it first and you walk through the first dab and now you go a little bit up towards where you transition like so. And now when you bleed, you can go ahead and freestyle and okay? just like dab it well. Yes. Now I go back with my transition color and I mix it with the black that, that one all the way up here. Check this out. It's a bitch. Yeah. Can I see that? Now I want it darker. So for me, for my for, for it to be darker, I normally go in with my spray and just spray the brush two times. So the product can really stick. There we go. So I'll just be doing the same thing on the other eye. I'll fix it later. So I'll just be doing the same thing on the other eye, guys.
So yeah, this is how the eyes are gonna be. And I really do feel like adding a bit more of dark towards it, of um dark towards the end right here. There we go. Everything that's like a bit extra on the side, I will go in with my concealer. Add a little bit of eyeliner, but this is up to you. Just a little bit, like I said, because this is smoky. cannot really see as much because I want the eyeliner to just be where the um, eyeshadow starts and yeah from there I'll add some bronzer and I'll add some here as well you know like the dark bronzes this is the bronzer that can be used like a highlighter not like a very dark one. It's by Bobby Brown. Bronze glow by Bobby Brown. Yeah. Now we'll go in with my um contour and contour my cheek and my forehead just a little bit because you know we are beginners so and the out of my nose now I'll go in with my highlighter Put a little bit, put it on my brow bone. Something on the other side. I'm gonna keep it go. And now I'll work on my lips. I will use a um, red to act to um line my lips. Cause remember, we're going for a red lip today. I can just use it to line it and to fill my lips. Just like so. Yes, guys, this is 
is the finished look. Let me go fix my hair and I'll be back to close up the video. So now I'll be adding my spray at the end. I didn't put it on the clip before this, so yeah. So yes guys, this is the finished look. What do you guys think? And yeah, this is beginner friendly. You can use any, literally any dark eyeshadow and like brownish eyeshadow to achieve this look. And yes, guys, and just add a red lipstick and you do your, um, I call it fake highlight and contour because it looks like I did all the full face makeup, but it's not. So yeah. So guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to check out Ching's channel and i'll be linking it down below and also um make sure you subscribe on this channel if you haven't and follow me on all my social media platform that's instagram twitter and snapchat once again thank you Ching, for collaborating with me and i really enjoyed doing this look with you and yes hopefully you all like this video and left some comment down below and yeah i'll catch you guys on my next video bye guys and happy early valentine's day <laughs>